Kavita Krishnan joins us right now on the phone line. Uh, she's an activist and is known for uh, a strong stance, particularly against uh, sexual offences. Ms. Krishnan, now Akhilesh Yadav claims this was a comment taken out of context. Uh, the other Samajwadi party leaders who've come on air and said, look, he was only talking about the death penalty against rape. Uh, is, is, is this really, is this something that you would agree with? So there are two issues here. One is that uh, the women's groups have been principally against the death penalty for rape, but that is not where Mulayam Singh Yadav yeah. is coming from. He is not saying this is a severe offence. He is not saying the death penalty for rape goes against gender justice, which is what the women's groups are saying. Exactly. What Mulayam Singh Yadav is saying is that boys will be boys and that rape is simply a mistake. He is not acknowledging rape as a crime and a crime of severe dimensions. I just heard Akhilesh Yadav's comments uh, defending his father and I find those to be equally objectionable because essentially what he's saying is that some rapes are severe and on that the whole country is united and so on and so forth but other rapes uh, uh, in other instances are relatively more trivial. That is what he's implying by saying that his father's remarks would not have been in the context of the severe and serious rapes. Now that's the whole point, that you see, when a woman is uh, nearly killed or dying or whatever it is, mm -hmm. then of course uh, uh, even patriarchal sentiment takes it seriously. Yeah. The point is that uh, in the cases of rapes in general, most rapes, uh, do you take that, do you acknowledge that as a serious crime or do you uh, see it as being uh, something that boys do? Mm -hmm. something that it is all right for boys to do and you don't have to take it seriously as a crime. Yeah. This, I think, is the dangerous part and this is where, and I, I saw Mr. Mulayam Singh Yadav's remarks in detail. Yeah. He has also said that he would like to amend the entire rape law because he is uh, raising the bogey of false sure. claims of rape. Sure. And I think that this uh, feeds straight into patriarchal sentiment, much of which, I'm, I should point I, out, has not been coming only from Mulan Singh Yadav alone, but even from very high-profile people, for instance, defenders of Tarun Tejpal and so on. All right. So I think right. that, uh, uh, you know, in terms of uh, reform of the rape law, the women's groups too are uh, acknowledging and have, in fact, been demanding. The rape law that we wanted to see has not been enacted. In fact, there are many changes in the rape law that are required. Sure. We don't want death penalty. We want marital rape to be recognized. We uh, would even discuss other aspects of the rape law that actually uh, require Fair changing enough. in the context of gender justice. Fair enough. All right, Ms. Krishna, we appreciate you coming on and uh, speaking to headlines today. Thank you for your perspectives on this story.